Hi, I'm Lynn Kazali. What causes overwhelm? What brings it on and what makes it tough to handle? There are three key things we can have a look at. The first one, emotional overload. That is where dealing with a surge or a flooding of emotions, reacting to something. It could be emotions that keep building up over time, or they could be emotions that just seem to hit us, trigger us, or land on us in a rush. That's the first thing to look out for, emotional overload. The second thing that can bring on overwhelm is workload. So we end up being overloaded by work. That means we've often got too much on our to-do list or too much that we're expecting ourselves to get done. Can you imagine now how too much work and too many emotions or a lot of emotions start to get mixed up? But there's a third piece to overwhelm and that is information overload. So we've got emotional overload, work overload, and then the third one, information overload. And it can be really difficult for us to take in information when we already feel like we've got too much to do and we're struggling with an overload of emotions. So the best thing to do is deal with the emotions first, journal them, write them down, have a rest, step away. And then secondly, have a look at redesigning your workload. How much have you got on? How much are you trying to achieve at once? Stop multitasking and focus for some short periods of time to get a few things done to give you that sense of progress. And then the third thing, information overload, try not to pay what they call continuous partial attention to lots of things at once. Focus on one thing at a time. That is in the mornings, for example, you might want to go out for a walk and listen to an audio book. Why don't you just go for the walk? Stop loading yourself up with more and more and more information, trying to get more and more things done because that can lead to more and more overwhelm. Recognise these three elements that contribute to overwhelm emotional overload, work overload, and information overload. Deal with the emotions first, redesign your workload, and then information will be easier for you to take in.